Yeah? Oh, oh, just a minute. Hey, friends. Welcome back to Pastor Kevin and Friends. Remember my friend Kevin? Yeah, he's got something he wants to tell me. Just a minute. Oh, notice he's dressed up like a shepherd. He's got his little robe on and he's got his staff. So you're a shepherd? Really? He wasn't there when, who? Oh, he says he wasn't there when Jesus was born. But his grandma was. Hmm. What's your grandma's name? Mary Ellen. Hmm. She seems like an awful nice lady, especially if she allows you to be with me. Oh, she told you that when Jesus was born, there were shepherds and they were living out in the field. Do you think it was cold when they were living out in the field? Hmm. What were they doing? They were watching their sheep at night. That might be kind of scary because animals could sneak up on you and, and, and get your sheep or maybe get you. Oh, they weren't afraid of the animals? They'd fought them before, off before? Mm -hmm. Oh, what? He says that there were a bunch of angels that showed up that night and they were singing. But the main thing they said, two words, fear not. Hmm. Were you afraid? You weren't. Why not? <laughs> The angel told them not to be afraid. Isn't that what angels always say when they greet us and when they meet us? They say, fear not. It is, huh? But why do we fear? Oh, you didn't need to fear? Why, why, why weren't the shepherds afraid then and why are you not afraid? Because the angels said that Jesus had been born. Hmm. That's important because Jesus being born makes a big difference. He would save his people from evil. All they had to do, what? All they had to do was ask Jesus to be their forever friend and he would be with them and protect them. And just like the angels were with you, Jesus is with us. What? Oh, one of the names that we call Jesus at Christmas is Messiah or Emmanuel. Emmanuel means what? Emmanuel means God is with us. That's true. And the Bible also says that God will never leave us nor forsake us. And when Jesus came, Jesus is our forever friend because he is always with us no matter where we go. You need some sheep to watch. I don't know if I have any sheep. But you're going to continue to be a good shepherd? That's right. One of the things that made those shepherds that, her, that the angels came and talked to made him so good was they went and they found Jesus lying in the manger and they worshiped him and they went away praising God. Huh? Oh, we can praise God anywhere at any time for the things we have and even the things we don't have. We can give praise to God for that. Wow, Kevin, you sure are a smart shepherd. Where did you learn all that? From your grandma, Mary Ellen. Hmm. She is a pretty smart lady. Oh, and she's a sweet lady. Hmm. I think you're right. And I think I know some of her friends that make her that way. What? <laughs> grandma remembers not to fear because Jesus is always near. That's a good idea to remember. We do not have anything to fear because Jesus is always near. And I believe that's something that we need to remember this Christmas season, that when we are afraid whether or not we'll do well in school, whether or not people are going to like us, or whether or not anything, we don't need to fear because Jesus is near and we don't need to fear. He is always with us. In fact, his word tells us that he is an ever-present help in times of trouble. And Kevin, I am sure thankful that Jesus is near, but I'm also thankful that you're nearby to be my friend and tell me about this amazing name of Jesus, Emmanuel, God is with us. All right, what? Oh, goodbye friends from me and Kevin. So from Kevin and Kevin, goodbye and have a wonderful Christmas season. Bye-bye.